A lot of people ask me, Harley, what about the raw food scammers? The scammers in the raw food world, the hucksters, the slicksters, the, the scammers, the multi-level marketing style, gimmicky, fad, spammy nonsense, the fruit phobics, what's the deal? Can you do a video about that, sharing your opinions and criticisms and comments? Well, I've done a few videos in this one, but we'll do another one, just in case someone doesn't understand. Because let's just say you're a newbie, and you've come into this lifestyle, you're absolutely newbie, you're like, wow, raw food's really cool, it makes sense, awesome, and you come into this lifestyle, what are the things to look out for? What are the warnings to know that the person who's telling or selling you some information or product is out to take your money out of your pocket, is out to huckster you, to slickster you, to snake oil infomercial bombard your ass, to dazzle you with so much spiritual woo-woo bullshit, you're like, oh my God, that's so awesome. So be warned, and I'll give you the points to look out for. First point, is always be careful of anybody who says fruit is bad for you. Fruit has got too much sugar, don't eat fruit. Just be really aware when people say fruit's bad for you. Your alarm bell should go up, your your spam antivirus system should be going full red alert. Whenever someone says fruit is bad for you, go to their website straight away or after the seminar or whatever and look up what do they sell. 99% of the time, they sell you a refined sugar, a refined sugar, and a definition of refined sugar is a sugar in a jar with no fiber, no protein, it's refined, it's come from a factory to get into that jar state. Now what is a refined sugar? Honey, xylitol, yukon, lacuma, coconut nectar, coconut crystals. Instead of saying coconut sugar, because sugar's like got a stigma word in the fruit phobic, low carb, you know, raw food world gimmicky thingy, Instead of calling it sugar, call it a nectar or crystals or, or fairy dust. Call it some fucking name that has no relation to the actual definition of it. Sugar. Just call it a fucking sugar. If you're going to sell sugar, call it sugar. But don't bullshit people. So anyways, we've got all these refined sugars. You go to their website, you go, hang on, these people say don't eat fruit. Why? Because when you eat fruit, you don't want refined sugar. Now, I'm not against refined sugar as much. I'm just for fruit. I'm pro fruit. I'm eat all the fucking fruit you want. That's what I'm pro about. Refined sugars aren't that bad. It's the shit they accompany. Crack out, oil, dairy, grease, preservatives, colorings, excess fat. That's what refined sugars are commonly connected with. So these people want you off the fruit so you buy more of their refined sugar spiritual woo woo bullshit. They want you off the fruit. They want to sell you refined sugar in a jar, auto ship, FedEx, DHL, straight to your door, US Postal, don't eat fruit. Eat fucking xylitol. In my opinion, that's wrong. That's scamming. Don't eat fruit because it's got too much sugar and you can buy it from your local grocer and I'll miss out the sale. So buy my sugar in a refined little product. You'll be floating in the Pacific Ocean in five years' time. Buy it now at cost. Shipping today. Auto ship. Now. Get it. Okay. It's raw. It's really raw. It's really, really raw. It's really, really, really raw. And it's been spiritualized by a fucking monk. And the Mayans lived on it. You know what I mean? So it's, it's hilarious. you got to watch out for the hucksters. Don't eat fruit. Don't eat fruit. Don't eat fruit. Buy sugar. We're going to spell salad today. You'll see it. You'll be able to talk about sugar. And then you look at the back row. You're like, oh, hang on. They're selling just sugar. Always look to the back row. Look to the website. Follow the money. Follow the money. If you want to see what someone's on about, follow the money. All these raw food dudes... The hucksters in the raw food world always promote a diet that creates deficiencies and then they always sell the antidote. Now this is the model, pay attention, we just cover it with fruit and sugar. Don't eat fruit, so you're going to crave sweet, oh we'll give you the antidote, you can just buy some of our raw food processed sugar. And then what people do, then they put you on the low carb thing, oh don't eat too much sugar, they will sell you the sugar, but don't eat too much. And then you need some energy, you've got no sex drive, so they sell you maca. You've got no energy, so they sell you crack owl. You got all these hormonal issues, so they sell you plant modulated receptive bullshit from China that's selling for ten cents a pound and sells for four hundred bucks a pound to the gullible war foodies in Sydney or LA or Paris. So have you ever noticed that? Don't eat fruit, buy sugar. Uh, don't eat too many calories. Be, become a breatharian, aspire to be a breatharian, you know, be a sun gazer, hippie, stoner, smoke bongs, don't eat fruit, take ayahuasca, take magic mushrooms. Ayahuasca is the best ever drug. It's the best ever for your kids. Take ayahuasca. Don't eat fruit. Fruit's bad. So there's the two main things as a raw food newbie you've got to be careful of. The fruit phobia and the calorie phobia. They promote low fruit, so you buy lots of sweet. 
They promote low calories, so you buy lots of stimulants, herbs, modulators, all this bullshit, because you're like, oh, raw food was sounding really good, but I feel like shit because I've got not enough calories and I'm constantly craving sweets, so I have some, some, some honey, raw honey from avocado land, and, uh, but I'm not eating many calories because I heard about breatharianism, it's really good, and calorie restriction, but I need some, I need some pick-me-ups, so I need some cacao, and I need some maca because I haven't had an erection for two months, and to be careful of those things. Stay tuned for more videos, like, share, subscribe. Share this video with a raw food newbie who hasn't been clued up to the hucksters and scammers that lie awake in the corners. So, ha ha, there's a raw food newbie coming through. Giddy up. <laughs>